A jammer is a device designed to disrupt or block radio signals, preventing communication between devices. The specific functionality of a jammer can vary depending on its type and purpose. But here's a general overview of how jammers work. Frequency generation jammers are equipped with transmitters that generate radio signals on the same frequencies used by the targeted communication devices. These frequencies can include those used by mobile phones, Wi-Fi networks, GPS systems, and other wireless communication technologies. Signal strength. The jammer emits these generated signals at a power level sufficient to interfere with or overpower the normal signals transmitted by the targeted devices. This disrupts the communication between the devices and their respective networks or satellites. Wide or narrow spectrum, jammers can be designed to interfere with signals across a broad range of frequencies, wide band, or focus on a specific frequency, narrow band. The choice of wide or narrow spectrum depends on the jammer's intended use and requirements. Continuous or pulsed jamming. Some jammers emit a continuous signal, while others use pulsed jamming techniques. Pulsed jamming involves transmitting intermittent signals, and it can be more challenging for the targeted devices to adapt and maintain a connection. It's important to note that the use of jammers is generally illegal in many countries due to the potential for disrupting critical communication systems and violating privacy. Deliberate interference with radio signals is against communication laws and regulations. Common types of jammers include cellular jammers, block signals in specific frequency bands used by mobile phones, GPS jammers, disrupt signals from global positioning system, GPS satellites, preventing accurate location tracking, Wi-Fi Bluetooth jammers, block signals used by Wi-Fi and Bluetooth devices, radar jammers, disrupt radar signals to interfere with speed detection or tracking. While jammers may have legitimate uses in controlled environments, e.g., military operations or authorized testing. Using them without proper authorization can result in legal consequences. Always ensure that the use of such devices complies with local laws and regulations.